The Long Beach Health Department did a study on North Long Beach, which is a neighborhood that has some of the highest rates of diabetes and obesity in the state of California because it's a food desert and doesn't have access to fresh, healthy food. So they asked residents, why aren't you consuming more wholesome, fresh foods? And the residents said, hey, we can't afford them and they're not here. And they said, what would change that for you? And the residents said, we'd like to see a fruit and vegetable exchange where we could share fresh foods. And so the health department contracted with Long Beach Fresh on a fee for service basis to establish this fruit and vegetable exchange. We built the crop swap with the local neighborhood association. This was a monthly gathering at an old firehouse where community came together and shared lemons off their citrus tree or all that chard that they were tired of eating at home. And it ended up creating an environment where over 40 tons of organic local vegetables and fruits have been shared. It's truly ironic that all of this food is in a food desert. We have some of the richest, most beautiful produce growing, but it's highly inefficient. You know, somebody might be, have a lemon tree producing a thousand pounds of lemons, they can't use it all. They get sick of lemons. And so this creates an exchange where what's not valuable to them in their abundance is shareable to others. It also helps in that you bring all these people who are gardening together and they kind of can help figure out and troubleshoot issues like, oh, you know, I tried to grow cucumbers, but there's all this powdery mildew. Oh, just spray it with a little bit of this compound and there you go. Now that production has been unleashed. We have incidents where someone brings tomato seeds and then three months later, the tomatoes are brought back to the swap to share. So it's become this amazing place where not only is food growing and shared, but community.